y'all, I'm digging Britt, and today I'm gonna make Texas Sunrise Potatoes. Texas Sunrise Potatoes are baked potatoes that have been hollowed out with a delicious egg and special cheese sauce, and we're gonna make little potato wedges too, so we can dip it all in the cheese sauce and egg and mm. Let's go over our ingredients, shall we? <laughs> okay, first we have Yukon Gold Potatoes and eggs, and for our cheese sauce we have Gruyere cheese, a ham steak, a little bit of flour, a little bit of cornstarch, some butter, and then if you really want to be fancy, you can add some chives on top. Okay, to start our recipe, we're going to take our Yukon Gold potatoes, and if you can get them larger, larger is always better. First, we're going to take our potato, and we're going to cut off about a third or less off the top and off the bottom. You cut off the tops and bottoms of your potatoes because the top is going to be like the top of your bowl and the bottom you just want it to sit nicely because if you don't cut off the bottom it will like like you know go away and you save the tops and bottoms for our wedges that we're gonna make later so you take your potatoes once they've had the tops and bottoms cut off you place them on your baking sheet sprinkle them with some olive oil salt pepper and then into the oven at 350 for 50 minutes to an hour So we take our potatoes once they've been baked and I'm going to cut a hole in the top so that we make our pretty little bowl and then we're going to scoop it out and with all the potato that you're pulling out of your potato bowl you can make mashed potatoes with later if you want to or potato pancakes or <laughs> you can make a hat out of them <laughs> whatever you want you can your dog your chicken I don't think cats like potatoes, but you could try. Now I have a neat little bowl. Beep boop. So I'm going to take this guy right here and I'm going to put him back in his home. Okay. So I'm going to do, I'm going to go ahead and cut the tops out of all of our friends so that we can make little potato bowls out of everybody. Lots of potatoes aspire to be a Texas Sunrise potato bowl. Not everybody makes it, but you can help them. You can help make potatoes dreams come true. Super fun. It's like sculpting or creating art. It's neat. I'm gonna start making the cheese sauce. I'm grating our Gruyere cheese to go in our sauce. I'm gonna take a ham steak and slice it up to add to the sauce. This recipe is so delicious, it's ridiculous. Like it should almost be illegal. My husband ate it and he said that it was one of two of the best meals I've ever made. So I always make him test out the things before I make them. So hip hip hooray for him. He really likes this one. <laughs> so whoever you make this for is gonna freak. This is absolutely delicious. Muy sabrosa. While I make our cheese sauce, I'm gonna start the wedges in our fry pan and it is full of canola oil and I have it on medium high heat. And you're gonna leave these in here, kind of turning them around a little bit carefully so you don't splash yourself. Um, they'll be in there for about 15 to 20 minutes or so. So be very careful when you're doing this. Go slowly, use your tongs, but carefully place them in. If it's not sizzling, it's not hot enough. I'm gonna turn on the stove to like a low medium. Put in about three tablespoons of butter. We're gonna melt our butter in our saucepan. And once it's melted, we're gonna throw in our little diced ham bits. And you can slice your ham as thin and small or thick and chunky as you like. We got yummy melted butter. Throw in our chopped up ham. Cook the ham a little bit, warm it up. I like to flip over my wedges so that I get a nice golden brown on all sides and even fry. So now we're gonna go back over to our special sauce. Okay, so now we have warmed up chunks of ham with two to three 
tablespoons of butter. I'm, I'm gonna put three to four tablespoons of flour in our saucepan. So I, I'm slowly adding about a cup of milk to my sauce and I want it nice and thick. If I don't get that nice thick consistency that I like, I'll throw in some cornstarch mixed up with some cold water to really get it extra thick. I just like my sauce thick. So. I like lots of things thick. <laughs> now I'm adding about a cup and a half to two cups of Gruyere cheese. All right, now our sauce is almost ready. Are you all excited? I know my cameraman is. After I've taken my fries out of the frying pan, I like to sprinkle some kosher salt on the top. I'm gonna put two big spoonfuls of our sauce in each little potato bowl. And now I'm going to take our eggs. I'm gonna separate the egg yolk from the egg white and I'm gonna put the egg yolk in the top. Ooh. After putting an egg yolk in each of our potato bowls, I'm gonna give it one more scoop on the top of our delicious ham and cheese sauce. Make it extra ridiculously yummy. Before we put this under the broiler, I'm gonna give it a little quick grind of salt and pepper. Now I'm gonna put this under the broiler for two to three minutes. I like to go more on the side of two minutes because I don't like my eggs to be overdone. I like it extra runny. If you wanna make your presentation extra, Fancy, you can chop up some chives. All right. Holy smokes, yes. Gorgeous. I'm going to sprinkle some chives on the top to make it look pretty. Voila. How delicious does that look? Texas Sunrise Potatoes, y'all. I'm gonna take a potato wedge and dip it. So yummy. <laughs> All right, y'all, thanks for joining us. Hope you all try it, it's super delicious. See you next time. Sunrise potatoes are. <laughs> okay, Texas sunrise potatoes. Texas sunrise potatoes. And then we're gonna make little potato wedges like fries to dip inside. <laughs> to dip inside. Texas sunrise potatoes are potatoes with. What? <laughs> and. An egg, <laughs> you can't talk, with a yummy egg and cheese sauce with ham. And now we're gonna, that are now, what, what's now all about? No, not now. Okay, Texas Sunrise potatoes are baked potatoes that have been, <laughs> sorry. Yay, you'll see. So, let's go. Let's get, get out of here. That sounds like a much better idea. You wanna go get drinks? There's a distillery down the road. Come on, let's go. Straight while you're doing it? Straight while I do it. Okay. Our ingredients for sunrise potatoes. Why is this here? Oh yeah, okay. <laughs> I can't feel. And you're gonna line them all up so they're uniform. <laughs> oh my gosh. Wow. I have potatoes, they're already ready. It's amazing. I must be a witch. Now I have a little, little but now I have a burning fingers. <laughs> So I'm gonna take this guy right here. <laughs> so I'm gonna take this guy right here and I'm gonna put him back on his wax on wax off. I'm gonna grate our Parmesan, nope. 
Now I'm grading. Now I'm grading. <laughs> Yay! So I get to go to a distillery today and drink my ass off. Why am I such a weirdo? Hippie parade. Who says fucking hippie parade? Only me. Thanks for joining us, Boop. <laughs>